everybody, how are we doing today? I hope everybody is well, good, fine and dandy. I guess fine and dandy is what I'm going to say every time now. What can you do? It's just what comes out of your mouth. Welcome to my channel, A Life in High Definition. Hi, how are you doing? New or old, I'm happy to see you here. So, what have I got for you today? Well, you know what it is. You've seen the picture. You've seen the title. You know it's February's Glossy Box. Look at that. Look at it. Just look at it. How cool is it? So, we have all these hearts. We have lipsticks. We have a cloud puking a rainbow. Can you see that? Cloud puking rainbow. Interesting. <laughs> Hearts with wings, rainbows on clouds, and on the back, it's neon pink with some lips on the bottom. How exciting, because this month's box, of course, is Valentine's. In fact, I think you'll find it's Galentine's, according to Glossy Box. Oh, I just need to put my leg up. Oh, it's so much better. Nothing like getting yourself comfortable. Let's just kick back, get comfy, and have a chat about this box. Glossy Box is a monthly beauty subscription box. It costs £10 a month plus £3.25 postage and packaging and it's pretty darn good. Usually, usually it's good. You can buy it in like three or six months um, blocks or whatever if you want to but I get it monthly that way I can pick and choose when to cancel it and cancel it and hopefully get it cheaper this month and got 20% off so that is always a bargain so if you want to see what is inside and what I think of this month's offering then I'd love you to just give me a big thumbs up before we go any further you don't want to forget do you don't forget thumbs up thumbs up all the way if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel what are you waiting for subscribe today it'll be the best thing you've done all day or at least for the last few minutes <laughs> You can hit the notification bell so you know when I upload and of course you can send this video out worldwide so everyone can enjoy me. Okay, let's get into the video. So we open the box and inside it looks like this. Now usually glossy box is now like a pale pink box and then it has like pink paper with a black ribbon but today we have a white ribbon and I don't know if it's got paper but it's got some it's got the information on top. Oh, look at that. Look at that paper. That's so cool. Okay, let's read the card. I'm not going to read all of it because I don't want to see what's inside, but I'm going to just read this. Welcome to the Galentine's Glossy Box Edition. This month is all about having fun out on the town with your BFF or your bae this Valentine's Day. We're so happy to have one of the best eye palettes we've ever had in Glossy Box alongside a cruelty-free Steve Laurent product wrapped in luxurious rose gold packaging. Now I got a Steve Laurent product, I don't know where I got it from, it was eyeliner and it is literally the favourite eyeliner, I've, my favourite eyeliner I've ever had. It's amazing. I am so rubbish at eyeliner but it makes even me able to do it. I mean I'm still not great at my flick but it means that I can do the top bit like really well. Love it. So I'm really happy to see another Steve Laurent product. Maybe he's going to be a brand that I follow. I don't really follow particular makeup brands, but maybe it's time to start. Do you guys follow a particular brand and buy all their stuff? Let me know down below. Anyway, I digress. Uh, Ciate is a brand which is taking the beauty world by storm at the moment, and we're in love with the Studio 10 Fixing Spray too. Oh, fixing spray, I can always do with that. A fixing spritz like this is a great way to ensure your makeup stays fresh and in place all day long. In other glossy news, we've been working hard to secure some very exciting and exclusive look fantastic offers just for you. They will be dropping in your inbox very soon. Now, Glossy Box has linked, I don't know if they're owned by or whatever, but they're like sister brands or something, but they're part of Look Fantastic now. So when you get glossy credit, you can spend it on the Look Fantastic site. In fact, on this box, I have £3.25 glossy credit because every month if you go on there and you give a review of your products, that you've had in your previous box um, you get like a little bit of credit and if you refer people as well you get credit for that so actually I forgot that so that was like £5.25 off my box in total yeah good box defo so it says refer how to spend your glossy credit refer friends complete your surveys and redeem your glossy credit on beauty products at lookfantastic.com or your glossy boxes so it's definitely worthwhile and I will put my code up here for you and I'll put it in the description box 
because if you want to try Glossy Box, I'd love it if you could use my code. But whatever you do, make sure A, you don't pay full price, and B, that if you do get a Glossy Box, you do all this stuff and get the extra credit because it's worth it. Why turn away free stuff? Right, let's get into the opening. It's the bit we all want to see. How do we like my camera position? I'm sitting a bit further back than I would normally. I just want to see how it goes. Right, wow. Okay, I'm going to pull this out first because I did just talk about it. And this is from Studio 10. And it is the Fixing Spray Makeup Mist Glow Collection. Okay. Oh, I'm scared. Is it coming? I don't know why I'm screwing up my eyes as if they're not already closed. Oh! Wow, that was intense. Oh! <laughs> wow! <laughs> that was like so intense. Okay, I have to just look in my mirror now. Yeah, I'm quite wet. I don't know if I'm holding it too close. Right, you need to hold it a literal arm's length because if you hold it any closer, it feels like you're being shot in the face. I mean, not painfully, but it feels like too much. But here, it's like a fine mist and you get your face. Because normally, I use my, um, what's it called? Uh, uh, Rimmel Instafix. And I'm like, Ch -ch 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 -ch. I like that one. This, I feel like... If you aimed right, you might be able to get it all in one spray, but it says it's a super fine, lightweight mist that forms an undetectable veil over makeup. Well, that ain't super lightweight and fine, is it? I mean, come on, you saw that. You heard that, didn't you? It was wet everywhere. Okay, it's dried now, pretty much. And it was a bit refreshing, um, but that was not the most lightweight mist I've ever had. For ultra long last where it soothes and illuminates and instantly refreshes and brightens dull and lacklustre skin, helping refine skin texture and reduce the appearance of open pores. Shake well before use. Mist face from 20 to 24 centimetres. Oh, I didn't shake it. See why you should always read instructions before you do these things? Maybe that's what it was. It was all in the shaking. Do you think that's sh shooken well? Has been shook well? Has been shaken well? How do you say that? Right. 20 centimetres. Well, that's about... 10? 20 here? Right. That felt very wet, but it's not that bad. I don't think the shaking made any difference, though, to be honest. And I got about this much of my face. I still need this. You see, oh, I'm one of these people that if I get one bit wet, I have to get the other bit wet. Right. Oh, it's so close. Ah. Right, I'm all wet now. Again. I guess this makeup is going to be on forever, and I've probably used up half my product now. But what can you do? We've got to test these things out. Oh, this is nice. So I don't even need to work out the price. This is travel size is fourteen pounds. So presumably this is a travel size. Cool. Okay, well, that's what I'm going to go with. Full size is £26. Okay, let's go into the next one. I've got to have this stevedore on. Oh, man. You know when you've seen other people's videos and you know what they've got and you're like, oh, I can't wait till I get that in my box. Yeah, I didn't get that in my box. But what I did get is this, because I think everyone's getting this. It's from Steve Laurent. Look at that beautiful rose gold packaging. Mm -mm, looks so nice so what does it say it says this is a full-size product and it's worth 17 pounds 17 pounds for a lip gloss like who are you when you can afford 17 pounds for a lip gloss bougie as hell am i just jealous as hell oh i don't know that's kind of like a really nice pinky peachy nude color let's have a swipe it looks like this can you see it's almost like a sort of pinky rose gold colour in itself. 
I like that actually. I think that's going to look nice. I keep dropping everything. But I will put it on another day. And I'll tag it on Instagram. So follow me there at Alive in High Def. And then you'll be able to see it, won't you? Just says this gorgeous creamy lip tint is cruelly free, hydrating and long lasting. Right, what have we got? Break rules. Ulution.com forward slash gift. What is this? Ulution balances my skin. Organic ingredients plus 65. I love eye contour. Okay, anti-dark circle and puffiness. Antioxidant. Well, I need this in my life. I am almost out of my Balance Me Eye Cream that I've been using. It's 15 mil. Sorry, I took so long over that. I was just a little bit confused because I've never heard of this brand before. But better. Right. And on the back it says break rules. So what is this? The organic ingredient ingredients in this lightweight eye contour cream work to hydrate, shrink blood vessels and drain away puffiness. Okay, do they now? So every time I get tired, I just go so weird and I just make stupid noises. Oh, that's a lot to put out for eye cream. Doesn't smell. Should we just add it to my under eye now? Because I don't want to waste it. I'll let you know how that goes because I love an eye cream. I like it when my eyes look better. I'm always tired. I feel like I've had eye bags since I was 12. <laughs> but they only get worse with living. So I will definitely keep you guys updated on this and whether it's worth 31 pounds. Okay, so the thing I'm jealous of is the 24 hour Acre Repair Facial Serum. Full size, 64 pounds, and it's 30 mil. But I actually already have it full size. <laughs> Where did I get this from? I can't remember. I'm using this at the moment, in the day, along with my Skin Chemist Wee, <laughs> Wee, um, Essential Hydrating Day Moisturizer, because I thought, you know, they're made by the same company, I guess they should go together. So that makes me a little less jealous. At least I have some, at least I can try it. I'm not missing out and I get eye cream on top. Yay. So maybe I'm a luckier egg than I thought I was. This is really nice actually. If anyone is interested, it is, it's got quite a big nozzle and I put loads out the first time I used it and I was like, no, that is my super expensive cream. So it's just a almost clear gel and it spreads out very really well so you can get quite a lot out of the tiniest bit which is great but yes you might get this in your glossy box and i do think it's really nice it does make my skin feel really nice it goes a long way this i also like okie dokie okie dokie i've got this this is very cute it's a ciate mini uh in the in the color gold digger that's quite nice that's like a really nice sort of party nude colour. Yeah, I like that. The mini size is 5 mil and it's worth £6. I am so ha happy. Glossy Box, you are amazing. Thank you so much for putting all the prices on here. Do you know how happy that makes me? Just saves me like about half an hour of searching things up, typing them down, getting the codes. Yeah, real happy. Thank you very much. So there's various colours, geology and paint pots. Say hello to this month's discovery brand, Ciate, based in London. I wonder if that's what they're going to do. They're going to do a discovery brand each month now. Based in London and loved by Beyonce, Adele and Kylie Jenner, to name but a few, this fearless brand is renowned for its huge range of colours and powerful creativity. But most importantly, we love Ciate's no-nonsense approach to animal cruelty. Your Ciate nail varnish is PETA certified and vegan friendly. With a gel finish, Ciate's polishes allow flexibility to minimise chipping and provide up to 10 days of high gloss shine. Six pounds. Cool. So we've got three full size items, one travel size item and one mini item, but with nail polish, that's basically the same as travel size, to be honest, because that's going to last you fairly well. And our last item is this. An eye divine palette from Sleek. Now, normally I'm used to getting the mini ones, which are about half this size, but look at that, it's a beastie one. Oh, it's got all the colours on the back of the box. Create stunning eye makeup with 12 shades of highly pigmented and long-lasting mineral-based eyeshadow. And this is the Storm Palette 578. It contains shimmery neutral beiges and gorgeous shades of dark blue, green and copper. 
Includes a matte dark colour ideal for definition or perfecting a classic smoky effect. Suitable for all skin tones. Oh, oh funny. The mini ones are also worth $8.99. And they've got the same amount of colours? That's really weird. Why would you buy a mini one when you could buy a full size one for the same price? Or a bigger one. I mean, that's really odd. As with all sleep products, it comes like this. The black writing, the touchy, feely stuff there. Oh, can't open it. Oh, comes with one of these. I still like them. I know people hate them, but I still like them. So the colours are also on the box. So if you lose this bit of paper, you'll be okay. I'm defo going to do... Why do I keep saying defo? I'm defo going to do an eye look with this. Oh, look at some of those shimmers. I cannot wait. This is a really nice one. This is definitely my favourite out of them all so far. Look at that purpley colour. Wow. Yeah, let's do some like temporary eyeshadow. I know that's not super blended, but no, it's just a couple of swipes on un um, prepared eyes. Just done the shimmers in this top row, just so you can see how they gleam. Oh, you know, and you think, why didn't I prepare myself? Can you see those colours? Look at the shining, 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 shining. Let's have a look at those shimmers in the bottom now. Okay. So we've got, I don't know, it's like a browny, coppery colour. And then we've got that beautiful blue, that beautiful green, and then like a more purpley indigo blue. So nice. And look at those colours. Why am I doing it that way instead of that way? Why am I making it so difficult for myself? What is wrong with me? God, it's bad enough holding my arm up as it is. Never mind doing it the wrong way. The matte colour in the top row, in between like the gold and the sort of pinky colour, and then the brown and the black. And they look like that. You see that one's definitely sort of a crease blending out colour because it's not that potent. Yeah, not bad. This one's nice. This one's a little bit chalky and this one's a bit like, I'm not even there. But, you know, for crease and blending purposes, that will be fine. So I think there's a few looks with that. Maybe I'll even use it for my Valentine's look. I don't know. I've got to make that tomorrow, have I? Because it's Valentine's Day tomorrow and I haven't done another look and I've got to tell you the rest of my love story because I know that you're all desperate to hear it. Are you desperate to hear it? Be desperate to hear it. If you haven't watched part one, then what are you waiting for? I'll put a link for it up there. Okay, now that's over. <laughs> uh, I'm going to have no subscribers left by the end of this video. Yes, yeah, so this box is worth £76.98 and that is not bad for a box that is priced at £13.25. And there are some really nice things in that box. Like, I cannot wait to do the eye cream. What? What? what where am I going with the accent? And as crazy as that spray was, you know, my face feels nice. It did refresh me. It certainly did wake me up. The eye palette is great. The lip um, thingy is great. The lip colour, whatever it's called, balm. And I love this packaging. I'm glad to have a little package mate for my eyeliner. And the nail polish, it was really nice colour as well. So yeah, this is a really nice box. And for Valentine's Day, you could definitely share this with your gal pal and get dressed up together. I'm just curious. So the other items that we didn't have were Rodile Glamour Lash Mascara XXL. That was a full size one. I'm glad I didn't get that because I've got two of them already. So thank you so much, Glossy Box. It is a nice mascara, but I don't need three. The other items was Icona Milano Emotion Allow Mascara. With a creamy formula, perfect for body, extreme volume that lasts. This mascara is cruelty free and smudge water and humidity resistant. That was worth £15 or the Skin Chemist London product. So that was your option. So you either got the eye cream or you got those things. The only issue with that is the people who got the Skin Chemist product because it's worth £64, they got a £110 box and I got like a not 110 which is okay 
but I almost feel like they should put in two products so the boxes are worth the same thing. No, I don't almost feel like, I definitely feel like that. Like, if one person gets a box that's worth £110, then everyone should get a box that's worth £110, even if that means they get an extra item. I don't know, what do you think? Do you think that would be more fair that everyone gets the same value box or do you think that it's fair, it's just the luck of the draw? I mean, if you got a Rodial mascara, you'd get one that's worth £24. If you got a Milano mascara, it'd be worth £15. And then your other option, I was lucky because my eye cream, which I really am happy about, is £31. And then you get the Skin Chemist London, which is £64. So this that's worth more than double mine and mine is worth double that something else. And if you got if you got the Milano mascara, the skin chemist cream is worth four times that. It's good to know what the other things are, but I, that kind of now also makes me jealous. Although sometimes you do see it on the website anyway, but I've never seen it in front of my face and seen the price before. I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing. I love that they put all the prices on there, I really do but I do think that each box should be the same value. So your neighbour shouldn't get a box that's worth 30 pounds more than you or 45 pounds more than you. Let me know what you think down below. That I know that's not a massive criticism. I am so happy with all the things I got, They're all nice things, but yeah, it just to me feels equal if we all get the same value box, ideally a 110 pound value box, because you could have just thrown in a mascara if they thrown in the Glamour Lash with mascara, then that would have been almost the same price. That'd be about right. And I'd be like, okay, you know, fair enough. It's only like 10 pounds out or something. That's that's okay, I can cope with that. But being 30 pounds out feels a bit like, oh. I know I've got it, so I sound like a greedy, greedy pig, but it is nice. <laughs> anyway, let me know what you think, especially how would you feel if you got a 15 pound mascara instead of a 64 pound cream? Maybe if you like makeup more, you wouldn't care, but maybe you would. It's not all about value because stuff has a value more than the value. We are greater than the sum of our parts. Isn't that how it goes? Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope I didn't go off on too much of a tangent here, there and everywhere. And I hope that you will catch me again soon because I've got more unboxings. I've got subscription of the week. I have got more vlog stuff. I have got a Valentine's makeup look. I've got live for less. I've just got stuff, stuff coming out of my ears, it feels like. So until you see me again, take care of yourselves and each other and live every moment well. Bye.